Oh, we almost got one of the birth is dead already. This is promising. Hey guys, well, this is a very different type of video. You have your King New playing a mobile game. Now, why would I be telling you about a mobile game? Well, I've honestly been addicted, but I'm gonna be even more honest. This is a sponsored video by Age of Z Origins. I've actually been playing this game every day, nerd alert, because I actually enjoy it, which is such a relief because I would not wanna make a video about a game that I didn't enjoy. Bruh. Thirdly, I actually also need to grow my alliance. Don't let the fact that it's a mobile game fool you. The world is actually massive, and we've already been bullied twice by some massive super alliance, and the drama that unfolded was quite unpredictable. Needless to say, I've been trying to recruit as many people as possible because the bigger your alliance, the stronger you are, and you can fend off these bullies trying to steal your resources. But wait, 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 let me back up. I've gotten way too ahead of myself. So what the heck is Age of Z Origins? Well, in its most basic form, it's a tower defense game, but in reality, you're upgrading city buildings, building an army, playing multiple mini games, and interacting with hundreds of players and alliances in a massive multiplayer world. It's surprisingly immersive. Now, one of the day-to-day -day steps and things that makes this game very addicting is there's always rewards to collect, there's always something to be building, troops to be upgrading, and resources to be gathered. And of course, as specific buildings level up, they unlock new perks such as stronger units, abilities, and increased resources. So the city that you're managing has an overall battle power with various specific buffs that come from a variety of sources. Officers, technology, equipment, skill upgrades, and a heck of a lot more. Now where this power comes in handy is expanding the borders of your city to allow more room for building, attacking fellow players and alliances to steal resources, and defeating zombies for even more rewards. Now, when I said this was a massive world, I was not exaggerating. The maps are huge and host an insane amount of players. Each nation eventually gets its own government per an epic showdown between the strongest alliances. And as I mentioned earlier, we've actually suffered at the hands of two of these big alliances, which deserves its own story time in the next video. At first, it may seem like the tower defense is a walk in the park, but boy, oh boy, how that changed quickly. Once I got to level 16, it literally took me weeks of attempts before I could get three stars on it. There's an addicting level of strategy to not only the location of where guns are placed, but the timing of the upgrades to them. There's also an unlimited mode where you can see how long your defense holds up against unending zombie hordes. In this mode, you're able to restart a wave if you can see your defense is failing, so I've been hooked on constantly making adjustments just to see how long I can survive. Seriously, I'll log on to play for a few minutes and realize it's been an hour. I need to get back to work. Anyway, if you've watched this far, you're probably asking, how do I join your alliance? And that is the right question. So after you make your account, your city will be placed in a random nation. After you go through the tutorial steps, click on the bottom left to go to the nation map. Then click the map icon to reveal the globe. From here, navigate to nation 485. In the bottom middle, click on the XY coordinates and navigate to 260 by 115. Then just click on the Alliance Hall here and request permission to join. The cool thing about being in an alliance is we can support each other's attacks and defenses as well as share various resources and stats all for the greater good. And one last thing, the developers actually gave us a promo code to get some additional resources in the game, which is SkippyFX. To redeem it, just go to My Info, Settings, and Redeem Gift. Guys, thank you so much for watching this far. I hope you will try out Age of Z using my link in the description to help support the channel, and I hope you have a blessed day.